nations uh, established what it called was the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. The Universal Declaration of Human Rights, Article 13, specifically speaks about the right of any individual to leave and to return to their home. And specifically states that every individual has a right to do that. So you can leave and you can return. Uh, seems like a natural right. You wouldn't probably, most of you here wouldn't have come here today if you didn't, if you knew that, for example, you couldn't go home after coming here. You probably have stayed at home, right? But you can go home. Yeah, so this is, and you, you take it for granted. It's such a natural right, you just take it for granted. Um, you don't have to be expelled from anywhere, from your home, to have that right. You can, you can leave, you know, when you feel like it, and you can expect to return when you, when you, uh, when it's time to. Um, so somebody in Palestine, for example, who went to Brazil on a holiday in 1920, yeah, since today he has that right to return unless he was denied. Okay. And denied it means it's being, being prevented from even practicing that right. In other words, they didn't need to be, have been expelled to Brazil to have that right. I think that's important and I'll come back to it. Um, the, right, the next day after the Universal Declaration of Human Rights was adopted, the United Nations passed a resolution on December 11, 1948, <coughs> passed through what is known as General Assembly Resolution 194. In that resolution, it specifically uh, called uh, uh, for the return of Palestinians and stated, in fact, that Palestinians have the right to return to their homes and any refugee who wishes to return can do so at the earliest possible date. That was the... And this, this resolution has been affirmed by the United Nations since 1948, practically every year, in fact more than once every year. It's been affirmed over 135 times since 1948. So this is a right that's enshrined in the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. It's also enshrined in at least five instruments of international law. And it was the, what the United Nations Resolution 194 did, in fact, was to say that Palestinians, like everybody else, have a right to return to their homes. And that's basically all it did. Um, and as I say, it's been reaffirmed since then well over 135 times. Uh, other people who have been expelled from their homes or due to war left their homes, like the Bosnians, the Kosovars, the Rwandans, even uh, German Jews who were picked out of uh, Germany have been granted this right, and many of them, in fact, have returned and or receive compensation for this um, the, for the period that where they, they were denied their right to return to their homes. Palestinians in 1947, 1948, and even to the present day have been uh, picked out, attacked, and dispersed from their 